We will make a high voltage AC power supply using these three components. This is an ignition coil, like the one you have in your car, a light dimmer, and a capacitor. The ignition coil has two terminals that correspond to the primary, and here is the high voltage output. There is a screw inside where you can attach the output wire. Let's now see how to make the connections. Notice that the primary terminals have polarity. This is marked positive and negative. The capacitor must be a polyester type with a capacity between 0.5 and 2 microfarads and a voltage rating of 250 volts or higher. This is the wiring diagram it's very easy, everything goes in series. This is our power supply ready for work. Here we have the input voltage from the house AC outlet. One of the wires comes to the dimmer. The dimmer has only two terminals. In the other side of the dimmer, there is the capacitor and from the capacitor you will connect to the positive terminal of the ignition coil. The other input wire connects to the negative terminal of the ignition coil. And the high voltage output is here and here. This connects also to the negative terminal of the coil. For insulation of the terminals, I am using a mixture of 50% Vaseline and 50% Paraffin. This is to avoid electrical arcs from the terminals to the can of the coil. Ok, let's see some arcs from the power supply. I'm going to turn on at the minimum of the dimmer. The distance of the arc is around 5 mm and this indicates a voltage of around 5 kV. Let me increase the power. At maximum power, the distance of the arc is around 10 mm, that indicates an output voltage of around 10 to 12 kV. Since the output is AC, we can use a voltage multiplier to get more voltage. In this case, a voltage tripler. Let me turn on the power supply. Okay, I hope you liked the video.